Hello, Real Fluency friends. I'm Trisha from RealFluencyNow.com, and I'm here to teach you real English used in real life so that you can reach real fluency now. Today's video is part one of a series of lessons to teach you vocabulary from the pilot episode of the American TV show, Big Bang Theory. This is actually two short videos that I originally made for Instagram and put them together to make a longer video for YouTube. Hello, I'm Trisha from realfluencynow.com. And for Fun Fluency Friday, I'll teach you some vocabulary used in the first episode of the TV show, Big Bang Theory. Number one, live together. You might think that this just means for people to live in the same place. And it can mean that, but usually it is used in a way that implies something else. It usually means that two people are living in the same place and have a romantic or sexual relationship with each other. In this episode, Leonard says to Penny, we live across the hall. And she says, oh, that's nice. And you can tell by her tone of voice and facial expression that she thinks they are a gay couple. This bothers Leonard because he is very attracted to Penny. So he doesn't want her to think that he is gay. So then he says, we don't live together. We live together, but in separate heterosexual bedrooms. He says it in a sort of nervous sounding way. The second one is holy smokes. Holy smokes is an expression that is used to show surprise. Penny says it after looking at the math equations on Leonard's whiteboard. You may also hear people say, holy moly, holy Toledo, holy mackerel, or holy cow. They all mean the same thing. And according to Urban Dictionary, holy smokes can also mean to smoke marijuana in a church. That's all for this week. And don't forget to come back Monday to get more help to stay motivated to learn English. And if you would like to keep in touch or ask me questions about learning English, then please join me on Messenger by copying and pasting the link below or clicking on the link in my profile. Goodbye, and remember, with hope, anything is possible. Hello, I'm Trisha from realfluencynow.com, and for today's Fun Fluency Friday lesson, I'll teach you more vocabulary used in the first episode of the TV show Big Bang Theory. Number one, widen our circle. In this episode, Leonard says, we need to widen our circle. And Sheldon says, I have a very wide circle. I have 212 friends on MySpace. What Leonard means is that they need to widen or expand their social circle. This means to meet new people and make more friends. Leonard said that after Sheldon criticized him for inviting their new neighbor, new neighbor Penny over for lunch, even though they had never invited over their previous neighbor. The second one I want to teach you today is Winds Up. Penny says, I'm writing a screenplay about this sensitive girl that comes to LA from Lincoln, Nebraska to be an actress and winds up a waitress at the Cheesecake Factory. Now, the Cheesecake Factory is a restaurant that Penny works at. Wind up can mean how something ended up, another phrasal verb, or ended, or that something is the result of something else. Um, like she moved to L.A. because she wanted to be an actress, but the result was that she became a waitress instead. Wind up can also mean like some toys for kids that you has something you turn and then the toy moves a little bit. You wind up the toy, wind up toy. People used to have watches too and clocks that had to be, that you would have to wind up to make them work. But of course, now they all have batteries. Now that's all for this week. Now don't forget to come back next Monday to help you get more motivated to keep learning English. If you would like to keep in touch, ask me questions about English or something, or just talk, practice a little English, then please connect with me on Messenger by going to my Instagram profile. And then you can find a link there that you can click 
where you can find me on many social media websites. Goodbye, and remember, with hope, anything is possible. If you would like to learn more English like this, then please click over here or tell me in the comments so that we can keep in touch. Goodbye, and remember, with hope, anything is possible.